Hello everybody, Mr. The Vest Man here, bringing you level 9 of Worse Must Die, and this one we're introduced to the flying enemy, and I'm going to use my typical stuff, because really to deal with the flying enemies, all you need are Archer Guardians. So as long as you have those, you will be set. And you can see here, I'm a little, I'm trying to decide what I need for my final one. And I'm like, mmm, Auto Ballista, even though I don't use it. So this one has two doorways. You have the leftmost doorway. Actually, I believe it's northmost. Uh, yeah, if you're looking at the main map, it's northmost. And what you're going to want to do is put these archers up. Normally, you wouldn't start with archer guardians, but you're going to want them there, trust me. They're going to help you deal with the flying enemies. And aside from those few archer guardians, you're going to go about these first couple waves the same I always suggest. Get as much money as you possibly can. And... On this level, once again, you're going to see an increasing amount of orcs, but just keep lightning, keep the crossbows, and don't worry, you do have the archer guardians there to help you. Wave 2, you're going to repeat the same process, try to maximize your amount of money gain. You'll have orcs, you might have the crossbow orcs, and here you can see the flying enemy. Now, they're not very strong, they can attack you with a fireball attack, so be careful, it's pretty powerful. Otherwise, just pick them off, continue on. Here in wave 3, you can see I finally destroy the money pad, and I put in the brimstone. And that's just because at this point, I've covered most of my upgrades, I've got what I need, so it's time to start using the uh, the brimstone. Plus the brimstone, as you can see, really helps cook those kobolds. Kobolds can be a huge pain if they get past you. Here you can see, during the wave, I put up a couple archer walls, and nothing too crazy. But what you're going to want to do now with, at the beginning of wave 4, you're going to want to set up some lava over here because this is when this door will break down. And once again, just repeat the same process. Lightning, crossbow, kill, 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 kill. Keep an eye to the on the other door. Sometimes guys come out of there, sometimes they won't. Wave 5, just fill out the traps a little more. I put a row of lava, full row of lava at this point, full row of spikes. You can see I've got some cobalts coming out of this side, one side, orcs coming out of the other. But the way we got it set up with the the brimstone and the archers, you're pretty well set. You can see I put up some archer walls, and I'm gonna start putting up a lava, a little lava wall there. That's on wave six. Still, pretty typical stuff. These levels, once you get into a routine of using the same traps over and over and learning how to maximize their effectiveness you can really just breeze through a lot of these levels wave seven all i'm doing same thing maintaining traps uh, not maintaining rather upgrading the traps uh lightning where you need it obviously make sure you upgrade your weaver uh i have the i have the upgrade so that every time a trap gets a kill it regenerates the magic quicker here at wave nine I'm just going to do more of the same. I'm going to set up some... I think I set up Archer Guardians. Is it on Wave 8 or 9? I do it eventually. I'm looking. I Like, I could see it on the screen. I'm, I'm, I'm deciding. It looks like I'm going to do it on Wave 8. I put up more Archer Guardians just to deal with the, uh, the enemies coming out of the door. But it's really not too crazy. Wave 9 here. The final one. I'm just going to put up another row of Brimstone. I frankly have the money. Why not? Uh, just a little side note, the flying enemies are weak to ice magic. If you want to use the ice magic, it will one-shot them. So just a little side note, in case you didn't notice that. Otherwise, there you go. That's it. Thank you for watching here at Xbox Life. Arcade fans, if you liked the video, please check out my personal channel, Mr. The Vestman, and we'll see everyone next time.